Hello everybody, this is Blaze here, and today we're going to be doing something a bit different. This is a normal gameplay. We're going to be actually doing a tutorial on how to install the TV mod in Minecraft. It's uh, it's not that hard, but it's not that simple either. Um, I've already wa I've went I've went ahead and downloaded all the files that you need. I will link them in the in the description, so you don't need so you don't need to do it yourself. It'll this is a Mac tutorial, not a Windows tutorial. I'm sorry. And actually, I will provide the link in a zip file with all four files in its own zip file. Um, or actually, you know what? I will not do that because I cannot do that. It is against the law, actually, because these files can only be downloaded from the original form page. But basically, you're going to need audio mod, mod loader, TV mod, and the Zuggler file. So to start off, you're, um, I'm going to show these in Finder. All four of these. Oh. We've got them all here. So, we're going to take these files right here. And we need to find our Minecraft.jar file. So I already have it um, on the side here, Minecraft. But what you but what you what you do to get it first is you get to go, hold down the Option key, and that'll make library appear. See if I let go of it, it's not there. Hold it, open library. And that'll show. Oh, and that'll show your library folder. And you need to scroll down, and you go to. Minecraft and it's not there. Hmm. Oh, you open you go to application support, then you scroll down to Minecraft, and here's that folder. So I'll just go to it directly through here. There's a shortcut, and you're gonna go to bin, and you're gonna want to open up Minecraft and make a force install to get a fresh copy of Minecraft.jar, which is the file that we'll be editing to install them on. So we're open up Minecraft. We're gonna go force update. We'll force login. And then you have to wait for that to download. Shouldn't take too long. Mine, are, mine always goes fast. Yours may go faster than this. I don't know what what's considered fast. All I know is that I've been on other Wi-Fi networks and mine goes the fastest. Absolutely, pretty fast. And that's downloaded. It goes to the Mojang screen. And here we're gonna go into the. Or we're actually just going to quit the game now that the now that it's generated. So now we've got Minecraft jar here. You're gonna need to download the Unarchiver which is a file on the Mac App Store. It is free. Works kind of like the Archive Utility, except it has more features. So we're going to right-click, go over Open With, and unarchive it. Now let's delete Minecraft.jar, because we will not need that anymore. I shouldn't have opened it. Alright, and then now we're going to go back to our Downloads folder. And we're going to open up a uh, mod. Oh wait, this mod you do not need. Audio mod, my mistake. You do not need audio mod. Alright, just mod loader, TV mod, and Zuggler. So you're going to select all these files, and you can drag and drop them in, but I prefer to copy and paste in case something goes wrong. I'll have a backup of the files and I won't have to re download it. So you press apply to all, press replace. Those are all downloaded. So we go back, and here we go into at the portal, um, TV mod. That you, just pre that you just double click to open, it doesn't really matter. And you've got that. And this goes into your Minecraft folder. This goes to Minecraft.jar. So select all this, copy, paste, and you're gonna press replace. Replace all. And then we're gonna go back. And we're gonna select that. We're gonna go back here, back to uh, the Minecraft folder. And this is where we put TV properties. We go back to downloads now. And now, what we're going to do is we're going to go to Zuggler, we're going to open that with the Unarchiver. Right click, do that, uh, it extracts, it's where it's made, making two copies but only one of them works. And then we're going to select COM, Zuggle, and yeah, we just take the COM, we copy it, we go to Minecraft and Charm, or just Minecraft, paste it, and it will replace all. It's actually pretty big, 122 megabytes. And so then, we go we're going to rename my, my, the folder Minecraft to Minecraft.jar. So now go ahead and open up Minecraft, let it run, logging in. There goes Mojang. Mojang. And it worked. 
works. Unlike most mods, you do not actually you do not need to delete the meta.inf file, which is strange. Some mods require it, some mods don't. And so then now we have generated a new folder. If we can go back into our Minecraft folder, we're gonna go to resources, mod, TV. And then in here you can drag in any file. I believe it can be either uh, it has to be a move file. And so then I already got these. We're gonna dr or just drag it in right into the TV folder. We can close out of those now. Go to Minecraft. Log in. So now I'll go on to a creative world that I made earlier. This is just some redstone traps stuff. And some messing around. Um, there's nothing I'll just show what that does. You run and it drops the sand right behind you. Unless you're sprinting, then it's really fast. Um, but anyway. We're in creative mode so the monsters will not attack me. In fact, let's just make it daytime so I can be have a better demonstration of this. Alright, now you just take out the, um, the items that you're going to need. I'll just open up some space. Go down, you take the TV, take the TV remote, make a, back make a background for it. Click where you want it to be. And it plays the screen. There's nothing. Walk up to it. Make sure your volume's up. Right click with the remote. And. Oop. And it begins playing. Whatever you have. And it will be very loud. <coughs> so you have to turn down your settings a lot unless you have. A good CPU. So I'm gonna put my cell phone on this. And it's also very pixelated, but it works. And this is Captain Sparkles' Revenge. Or not Revenge, this is Fallen Kingdom. Uh, Minecraft Parry of Evil And yes, it is very choppy and glitchy unless you have a great CPU. So. If you, I'm gonna try and turn all my settings down all the way. And to make it easier to do so, let's just run the TV while I do that. Go to video settings. Um, make everything off. Particles, minimal. Um, smooth lighting off. Performance, max FPS. Now let's see how this goes. And as you can see, it's still not running too smooth, but I am running on a, only a MacBook. Hopefully I can get a big, powerful Windows desktop computer, that really help. So basically, if you're running on any sort of desktop computer with most likely 4 gigabytes of RAM or enough CPU, it should run pretty much fine. Now it's going smoother. Based on the name, like the, the title of this is just F.MOV because it stands for Fallen Kingdom. But if you right click again, Or the farther away you go from it. So it actually looks like a real TV. It's great to have in your house. It looks really cool. The only problem is it really is loud. <laughs> so if you have a computer on it, go ahead and install it and work with it. Ugh, this is hard. 
This is Captain Sprunk's Revenge. Um, a parody of Usher's DJ just kind of falling in love again. Total shock fills your body. Oh no, it's you again. I can never forget those eyes, 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 eyes. Cause baby, tonight. This is, once again, a Captain Sparkle song. This is... Come on, play. This is TNT by Captain Sparkles, a parody of Tyo Cruz's Dynamite. And I'll just let you watch the rest of the thing on a laggy, pixelated screen, just for fun. Enjoy. I came to dig, 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 dig. I'll build a city out so big, 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 big. Just wait a sec, gotta kill this big, 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 big. Cook me some bacon, take a swig, 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 swig. Yeah, yeah, there must be something I can craft to ease the burden of this task. Yeah, I shoot my arrows in the air sometimes. Thank you very much for watching. So, um, until next time, this is Blaze. Thank you very much. Um, terrible outro!